Hi, CBC Music. Thanks for having me. My name is Sarah Sleen. I just put out a record called Metaphysics, and I'm here to show you how to play a song from that album. This song is called Sarah. Okay, fairly straight up. This song is in B flat major. Some say this is the key of the universe. I think Schubert uh, had that theory as well. Um, but it's a beautiful key, nice and warm, really cozy, and uh, it fits nicely under the hands. So the, chor the chords in the verse are very simple. We just have the one chord, B flat. Then you move up to the three minor, D minor, and then you go up to the four, which is E flat. So that's basically all there is to the verse, except we're gonna break up those chords into a rolling arpeggio that starts from the bottom and sort of cascades upwards constantly on every chord. So the pattern that I play is my five finger, my two finger, my thumb in the bottom, and I'm tracing B flat, F, and B flat. Just the one, five, and one of the B flat chord. And then I add my right hand, I add the thumb on the third degree of that scale up here. So that ends up sounding like this. Just like that. Four notes, right? But I do that over and over again on every beat. And I keep doing that on the next chords that come up. And what ends up happening is the thumb notes in my right hand sort of form their own counter melody like this. cool, right? So that's why you break it up. It's easy under the hands, but you also have this counter melody happening in the right. So when we do the same arpeggiated pattern on those three chords, it ends up sounding like that. I sometimes go to the five just before I go back down to the one because I'm classically trained and we do it as a reflex. Um, so that's the verse, very simple. And the same pattern applies to the chorus, but we've got different chords. So in the chorus, we have a D minor chord with that lovely natural seven on top, making it sort of jazzy and melancholy all at the same time. This is not the end going up to the four, which is E flat. And then we move all the way up to G minor, which is like, that's the knife in the heart right there. You will be loved. And then we fall back to the five, which is F. Again. But we're gonna still do that rolling arpeggiated pattern. So that sounds like this. are fairly simple, but when we break them up and make them constant arpeggios on every beat, it sort of sounds more interesting and more complex. And that's my song, Sarah. <laughs>